Hello, everyone. This is 40 Plus, and I'm Steve Pender. We're going to do a reaction today to Woods. Uh, this is the uh, accident, and it's the live clip, I believe. I hope I pronounced everything correctly. You know how I am about that. I kind of miss stuff. But uh, we got the spinning wheel of death right now, so let's see what happens. I hope it plays. Here we go. I guess it does. It's a bit dramatic. Okay, two things right off the bat, and this is not a critique about the song itself. This is about how he's using his microphone. Oh, God. Okay, do you, do you hear? I mean, it looks like it's a, a Shure SM58, and he's got, he's like kind of making out with it. Just throwing that out there. Don't, don't take offense. But you hear that like bass that he has that, that it's, it's a droning sound. It's really making it hard to even hear the enunciation that he's doing. Um, part engineer issue, sound, whoever's doing the sound for this. And, uh, he can, he can adjust that for him to be able to sing that way and still sound okay. But that's right off the bat. That's the first thing I heard. He, he's doing that because he's actually using his nose. I know that sounds crazy, but a lot of singers, they'll take that mic and they'll work that between their nose and their mouth because that's how they get the pitches that they need. So it looks like that's what he's doing. Bad engineer, not bad singer, bad engineer. Ooh, that was a note and a half. He actually had to pull just a little bit away on that. So they, they I'm going to sound like I'm just critiquing the sound engineer. The sound engineer has such a high compression amount and then a limiter on it. So when he really belts it, he doesn't even have to move. He can stay right on that mic, and it's not going to distort. The song is really cool. I'm, he's got an amazing voice. It's, I think this is the first time I've heard him. Oh, yeah. To be able to blast into a mic that close. Doesn't look like a 58 now, I see it. Mm. The song's good. I'm just it's the sound I'm sorry, the sound engineer is killing me. He's just killing me. It's a good song and the sound engineer sucks. Just, yeah, it just sucks. The sound engineer sucks. Got a great voice. Very well done there. Baby, I just wanna know who you are. Woo, whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, I wanna go back and hear that again. The little half step drop was awesome. Oh, that's cool.
He got he has a lot of power out of that falsetto of his. Wow. I'm wondering if this is just the engineer having to deal with it. Because he I mean, he doesn't have the greatest mic for doing this kind of singing. But he is just belting it. I wonder if that's why they had to limit the heck out of that mic. A great song. I love that bass. Very cool. Yeah, I was a little hard, you know, a little harsh on the sound engineer, but what are you gonna do? I'm kind of, yeah, that's that's my that's my area, you know. So yeah, I'm a little harsh on that. Anyway great tune great tune like i said a little rough at the beginning the way the sound engineer had to mix his voice and i kind of jumped on it a little bit but other than that it was a fantastic song great vocals um it's, it's definitely a mood setter mood setter you know um hey if you if you like it give us a thumbs up i'm sure i'll get a lot of thumbs down on this one if that happens but hey till next time take care everyone have a great day.